हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम पीयूष कुमार आई एम अ स्टूडेंट ऑफ थापर यूनिवर्सिटी एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन आउट टू यू माई सामा प्रोजेक्ट विच इज अवी रिकमेंडर सिस्टम नाउ वॉट इज अ मूवी रिकमेंडर सिस्टम अ मूवी रिकमेंडर सिस्टम इज समथिंग विच रिकमेंड्स आउट टू यूजर्स द मूवीज ऑफ देर प्रेफरेंसेज स्पेशली ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ द प्रीवियसली यूज डेटा सेट्स द यूजर रेटिंग्स एटसेट्रा एटसेट्रा नाउ लेट्स मूव टू माई प्रोजेक्ट here you can see that the uh, project consists of three parts the first part is movielens.py part 1.py is the second part and part 2.py is the third part you can see that i have worked on anaconda and spider is the ide for anaconda the language which i have used is python 3.5 now the movie lens dot py contains scripts to help load the movie lens data set into the python classes well also let me introduce that i have used the movie lens data set now all of these are the different fields of data which i have used you can see that here is base gener info item occupation test user etc the movie lens data set contains information of 943 users and 1682 items so you see this is a sufficiently large data set now this data set has different classes like user item rating and data set the user contains id age sex occupation average rate etc the rating class contains user id item id rating time etc and the data set contains scripts to load all of these into a data set now this is part 1.py we'll try to run part 1.py and i will then explain out to all of you the output okay this this was the input utility matrix the ratings of users for movies and this was the output utility matrix now you see the values which are zero in this utility matrix are actually those values those movies which the user has not rated you can see that there have been there are different users they have been rating different movies and these zero values indicate that these users have not rated the movies these movies now our work was to predict values for these ratings for these values for these zeros means had the user rated these movies then how much he would have rated now this you see is the complete output matrix also on the basis of mean squared error which is coming 4.27 now the mean squared error is actually the error between the observed values this 2.667 and the actual values of this rating now you see that i have built a, a number of functions to explain this this is the r average function which can computes the average rating for every user this is the pcs function and this is the guess function and also i made a class called similarity which contains the user id and the pcs values the pcs values basically a mathematical function which computes the pearson correlation similarity measure between any two users x and y and the guess function 
then computes the rating the predicted rating for user u item i taking top and most similar users okay now let's come back to movie lens.py we have once run this program okay so we have loaded the data sets now running part 2 of this program of this program will involve uh, importing the movie lens data set the numpy module and the mean squared error module now we have loaded the data sets into arrays computed the average rating for each user stored it and then we have run and then we run through the same functions the pcs similarity guess etc now let's try to predict a value for user nine user number 98 for the movie number 99 taking 400 most similar users now you see the value we have uh, the value has come this was the input utility matrix you see this is a very sparse matrix a large number of zeros and this is the value which we desired for which is 3.24558 means had the user rated had the 99th user rate 98th user rated the 99th movie then taking 400 most similar users the value would come out to be 3.24 now let's change these values and turn the user id to 56 and let's see what happens you see that it has come to 3.36725 so you can see that this is how it all works this is how the complete recommender system works